and we are back once again for day 20 and as you can see we just beat the huge nasty boss at the Garden of Hope and I killed it with three seconds remaining in the day Whew. maybe hopefully I'll get all my juice back it'd be nice it would be nice and I did not check my totals. So let's see my Pikmin total. Okay, that's not half bad at all. Not half bad at all. Still gonna take about 30 of those, 10 of those, X amount of those, X amount of those, X amount of those. Take the rest blue. <laughs> And yeah, I'll be chucking those guys. Oops, that was a horrible throw. Oh, look at this. It looks... Okay, there are. Okay, let's go over here. I got through six. Okay, so let's head back over here. Probably gonna have to uh, farm some more uh, spice. Whoa! Look at all that. That is crazy. That is legitly crazy. Holy crap, I need 20. That is ridiculous. I'm guessing because the thing was big, everything is big. That's their one last Pikmin. I have one blue. One, two, three, four, five. Throw a winged there. A winged there. Throw a yellow. Throw a yellow there too. And also uh, a usual drop from butterflies, like that red one you see above there, typically um, typically drops red, I believe. The spice liquid, nah, I can't even remember the exact name of it. So let's see if I can actually get a lock on it. Now, things freaking hate him. I got through about six, maybe. Yep. So officially, the worst hated boss. And if you want to see it in mission mode, good luck, cause I am not gonna like it. So now we're analyzing him again. Okay, now they just call him the food thief. Bing was in possession of 28 days by Zeus and one soft vinyl toy suitable for a toddler. Ah, I guess we get back our juice. Nice. Aha, nice. We finally got our juice back. So nothing to worry about there. Now, I'm trying to send out my uh, flying Pikmin to deal with them. Because I really would like some of that uh, chili or spicy, never mind, red juice. I'm going to call it red juice from now on. Well, just forget it. 
This is really starting to annoy me, so let's go ahead and head out. Uh, what's up there? Can I get up there? I think I can. No, no, wrong way. No, stupid. Ugh. Can I get up? Okay, I don't think I can get up there, but I'm gonna try. No, cause see, I'll go this way, and I'll be closer to... <laughs> throw a Pikmin up there, of course. Oops. Okay, well, it doesn't look like it's gonna work. It'd be nice, though. Alright, so let's go ahead and head back out. Well, instead of having this day go to waste, I suppose I can go ahead and explore a few a little bit more. So I'm gonna go look at my map. Now I still ha I can still get the fruit over here, um, which I could try to do. Right, there's something over there. Oh yeah, the giant, gigantic lobster thingy. And that's just the starting area like uh, everything else. So let's head back across. Okay, so since I have a bit of extra time, I may backtrack. There we go, I have all my pigment with me. See, there's the Wooly Mong. Er, yeah. God. I'm so horrible I remember these names. Oh well. Oops. Well, I didn't exactly originally plan on doing that, but actually, screw it, he died. There you go. Okay, I'll probably come back and get him later. For now, let's try and get over here. Flying Pikmin probably no. I don't even know why I threw. Oh my goodness, is this really not going to work? There we go. There we go. Figure out how this is gonna work. Yeah. 
Oh, come on, man. Really? Okay, I have an idea. I do have an idea this time. I'm probably gonna spend the entire day trying to figure out how to get up there, or at least attempting to. Okay, I'm actually gonna actually gonna throw those guys up there just in case. Oh really? Those guys are fit up there? It's pretty tight. There we have it. Excellent. Let's see what's next. Uh First off, I'm going to chuck a red. Okay. <laughs> ah, there we go. Okay. Okay. Well, I, I'm just, I'm just tired of wasting my time doing that. Either way, I, I haven't noticed this, but the bolts right there failed to notice that. So what I'm supposed I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna go ahead and fight that crab thing. If I can find my way back over there. Then take that back. And of course, they'll be fine since they're in the circle. Look at the map again. Uh, fortunately, I forgot where I had to go. Okay, that's something I didn't notice. There is a electric fence there. Oh, good gosh. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and hit go here to go there. Oh no, no, oh crap. Okay, I'm about to say, I'm get, get really irritated by this pigment. Crap, am I going the right way? Good gosh, I have a horrible sense of direction. Okay. 
Okay, so I gotta go by the flamer. Uh, that's what I call it. Ah, oh, and that's what I'm talking about. Just screw it. I'm done with the day. Okay, guys, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and end this day early. There's only seven seconds left. There's not really anything I can do. And I already have all my Pikmin. But if you want me to skip it in, in the uh, couple future videos, I will. That is the end of another day. So I got one fruit today, yet I got all my past uh, collections back. I think it's a papaya? I can't remember what kind of fruit that is. Eh, it's not a bad name. I'm gonna guess maybe two or three. Two or three jars. So we're at three, maybe three and a half. Okay, just three. Like, Ooh. I got my supply back. There we go. It's much, much better. A little bit, more like quite a bit. All right, guys, that was day 20. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. So I hope everybody get. So I hope all you guys. Well, actually, no way. This I think I, I still got a question, Louie. So do you read all that? Okay, good thing I didn't end it. Yeah, see? For those that haven't played it, as I've said, Louie, he is uh, the main character from Pikmin 2. Or one of them. He kind of sounds like a cow, in my opinion. And he has rubber ducky issues. And of course, uh, you don't entirely get the play as Louie, but look at this! We finally unlocked the next area, and the final area of the game, the Formidable Oak. Looks like it's in a desert-like region. Alright guys, uh, next time I'm going to start ahead towards the final part of the story at the Formidable Oak, so hope you guys look forward to it.